Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Yechi here. And today's video is different from the normal, you know, sit down and talk, how to video. I'm going to be jumping on the first time tag. Um, I normally don't jump on trends or even jump on like all these things, but I decided to jump on this one. I discovered it last week and I'm like, oh, it's, let me just give this a try and, you know, do this on my channel. So I'm going to be jumping on first time tag and that is answering questions about your first time. So I have about 50 something questions here. We might not go through all 50 something. Um, I'll answer the ones that I can. I'll try to answer as many as I can within the time frame. For this video ball i feel like this is fun and this is good because you guys get to know a little bit more about me and um, some of my experiences too so yes you know i'm really happy i'm excited so you know come and learn about my first times yeah so let's get into the questions number one here is first app you check when you wake up in the morning um number one is instagram yeah it has to be instagram or gmail i check my mail for any new you know mail that might come in but most of the time especially when i wake up in like the middle of the night it's like instagram honestly number two first broken bone never broken a bone i only hurt my wrist one time i don't know if that counts it probably doesn't but i've never broken a bone um first foreign country ever visited ghana First Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook post. Guys, I don't even remember my first tweet. I'm sure it was something with X up, works up, do all those type of things that we used to type. Something with like some serious short form, guys. I was the queen of short form when I started using social media, <laughs> honestly. Um, for Instagram, it has to be, I think it was the picture from, I've deleted it now. I had to delete it. But I think it was a picture from Interhouse Sports that we did and I was a banner carrier so I mean I looked really nice with like the sash here and there yeah I think it has to be that one that one was like one of my that was like my first Instagram post or one picture of me in secondary school shot Facebook post I think it was my baby picture yeah I didn't have any photo of me you know recently then so I just put up my baby picture um five first makeup items my first makeup item has to be wet lips like those things we rub on our lips there has to be wet lips after that maybe like in secondary school was kajal that's when i started you know learning one or two things about eyeliner i feel like a babe but like yeah those have to be like my first two things wet lips and then kajal that one that's like super glue mm -hmm. so number six first plane ride you ever went on so the first time i was on a plane was from lagos to kaduna I think so. Yes, Lagos to Cardinal. I was going to Cardinal to go and meet my dad. And I went with my sister. Guys, it was a very, very terrific flight. Because I didn't know that's how takeoff used to be. So my heart literally just jumped. I'm not going to lie. My heart just jumped. And um, ha, good. I was scared. Like I was so scared on that plane. Because when the thing just went up nah i'm like am i ever gonna be on a plane again and the sad part was that when we're not coming back we came back with flight and i sat down we sat down at the end of the plane like towards the toilet guys when we're taking off it was three times worse than the first time we actually took off never again will i sit down at the edge of a plane like never ever again honestly okay so next is next one here is first time you ever got into trouble at home and in school okay i cannot really remember but like as far back as gss2 i got into serious trouble for noise making like our class was above was above principal's office and that day everybody just went on and on we were playing we were gisting playing different kind of games that viral game we we're all making noise and you know the vice principal came upstairs and then she punished us we had to kneel down on tad road in the hot afternoon guys that's the worst one of the worst punishments i've ever ever received other than that my first time being punished at home probably before breaking something because that was what i did like growing up as a child if you there's almost nothing i've not broken plates cup um bowl and almost glass anything i've broken it growing up as a child so it has to be being punished for breaking something i remember the time i broke my mom's favorite mug i don't know she changed it for me <laughs> 
first time you are allowed to put on makeup i was probably really really young because i had elder sisters so most of the time when they are like trying to like do makeup and all i was really young let's say i was like six or so first time i put on makeup yeah yeah i think i was about six my parents weren't like comfortable with it till i was like a teenager you know all grown up and all first youtuber you subscribe to i do not recall i do not recall but one of the first youtubers that you know i subscribed to when i started like watching youtube properly was dim maume yeah i think so and one of all i think ay ay show because of comedy yeah so those would be like the first people i subscribe to okay first time you went shopping on your own guys you will not believe that i think this was like two years ago like two years ago like first time i went shopping on my own because i'm so used to going shopping with my sisters we're always together so we always like go shopping together with my mom but like two years ago i think i decided to go and buy my things for school and all my sisters were like away like married out of the country so there was no one for me to go with my mom was like that go to market and buy your things i'm like okay no problem let me go <laughs> as i entered the market in Ibadan and find a couple of things from school it wasn't a bad experience because i was already like familiar with like the market the prices there even though some people still try to cheat me but you know i know the carry last so i still knew a couple of things and knew my way around the market so it wasn't very very bad um 11 my first boyfriend girlfriend i'm not gonna say the name but um was in my 100 level that's when i had my first boyfriend yeah my 100 level november it was actually on my birthday that we started dating first car i never have <laughs> first celebrity crush oh my god my first celebrity crush i think could be osha i think so i really liked him growing up yeah um my first cooking experience guys this cooking experience i don't know if it deserves like a story time on its own hey goodness so my first <laughs> i don't even know how to explain the first thing i ever cooked the first thing i ever tried to cook was egg i tried to fry egg one morning so that morning my mom told me to eat bread and egg. she's going to the market and i start to make my sister should make um bread and egg for me so there was already bread she bought bread and then i should my sister just helped me fry the egg so i went to wake up my sister i tap 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 i'm like mommy said she cook for me i'm hungry i'm hungry i'm hungry i was, I was a really really small child she didn't answer she was still sleeping so i decided to man up i went to go and cook lucky for me i knew i'll turn on the gas so there was no explosion so i turned on the gas and then i cracked the egg I put the I put the pan on the fire. I added oil. I added hmm, added a good amount of oil. So I took frying egg as the way you cook yam. Because most of the time when they're frying things, they leave it on the leave it on the pan for a long period of time. So um, I decided to crack the egg inside my good amount of oil. Okay. So after that, the egg you know started frying, and then I was gonna sit down on the dining table waiting for the egg to like fry like after a while so like shortly after i started smelling like oh something was actually like burning so i went to go and check and i found out that oh my egg was already burnt underneath so instead of me to turn it over i'm like okay Yechi, the underneath is burnt the top part did not cook so that means that if you eat it together it will balance like burnt and uncooked both of them come together will give you cooked so i removed the egg from the fire like that and i went to go and eat the egg like that guys my first bite was i think i um, i forgot to put salt also <laughs> i forgot to put salt so my first bite was horrible and it was funny how <laughs> it was funny how that first bite when i had it that was the same time my star woke up and then came to the parlor and she saw me eating like guys she had the laugh of her life that day like after that day i'm like nah i'm gonna have to pay a little bit more attention when it comes to kitchen matters because that egg was was disastrous honestly okay my first crush my first crush i think he was like in grade grade three or so i don't know if it was a crush i just know that i was really really close to a guy and i really liked being around him yeah grade three first ever cell phone my first cell phone was multi-links you know multi-links the line and then they had this like small phone i got that phone in my grade three got that day i remember my dad warning me not to take that phone to school but i'm like no i'm gonna show them that yet she has a phone now and i took my phone to school 
he found out but like he found out like much later 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 maybe like end of the term that i took my phone to school one time and i didn't get punished for that glory to god because he really wanted me not to take that phone to school um first ever date first date um i can't really recall but it has to be it's the cinema that's like really all we had and all i could go to um being a teenager in Ibadan. so yeah um my first fear first fear of course would be fear of the dark i hated being in the dark alone a lot growing up like i would never stay in the house when it's all dark as a child so fear of the dark is still one of my fears i don't even sleep with the lights off these days i hardly sleep with the lights off like i sleep with, with lights off like twice a month normal nights i sleep with the lights on honestly first friend in college i don't really remember um but one of my closest friend was she was one of the first friends i made in in college her name is christy so um, we met when the same department so someone introduced me to her and then she was the only one like that in my department that i really clicked off with like fast you know she was really really helpful because i resumed quite late when they were about to start the first test so she was really really helpful to me and we just you know clicked fast i met other people born i did not really like your vibe but like we her, it was like oh she was good vibes i'm not gonna lie all right first heartbreak hey good so first heartbreak has to be in gs3 so i liked this guy for three good years like everybody knew about us everybody knew yichi and this guy where you know liking each other and all but like i did not want a relationship i mean i barely knew how to tie my shoelace as at just one just two so i did not want anything then until i was a bit ready so you know we liked each other for three years we're guys we're close his cousin was my best friend so we're all like all just vibing together and we're all guys um and he knew that i liked him i also knew that he liked me too then just says three ending up just three he now acts out another girl and fam i didn't see it coming the thing it hits me like it threw me back he asked out another girl and i'm like oh, okay then he started saying things like oh he didn't want to ruin our friendship and this and that i'm like oh <laughs> i've been zoned i did not know i was zoned then but now i know that then i was zoned and then he was like he didn't want to ruin our friendship i'm like oh okay <laughs> no problem <laughs> no problem then the girl told him no and then he came back to meet me and then he was like oh you know trying to you know get back to how we were and things like that and i'm like i'm not gonna be your second choice period guys i knew my worth since jesus three <laughs> but seriously i'm like i'm not gonna be your second choice and all like the only reason why you're coming to meet me is because she rejected you and also i was quite heartbroken then but i handled it well i think i did i think so first job okay so my first job was actually in my gs3 guys gs3 was such an eventful period of my life honestly my first job was in gs3 it was actually at a radio station diamond fm in ibadan and we're supposed to do a voice recording for a book so you know the way you have like children audio books just so that they can learn like pronunciation and all so that was what we we're supposed to do so we did the recording at the radio station actually the radio station that hired us to like do the recording um it was me another girl and then two other guys that you know did the recording of the book really really exciting i think they paid me 12k or 15k and then i felt like i'd made good money and that money my mom actually let me keep it she didn't say oh give it to me let me help you grow it let me save it for you weirdly she actually like let me have the money and then i think i probably spent it on shortbread and pringles that was all i cared about then <laughs> My first piercing, first piercing has to be the normal ones on my ear. Though on this ear, I repierced it in my SS3. Yeah, like when I was done with school, I had to repair it again because of a story for another day. First thought of today. I think the first thing I thought of when I woke up this morning was my YouTube monetization and reaching 4,000 watch time hours. So, of course, once I woke up, I started thinking about it. I went to go and check, okay, how many hours am I on? How many minutes do I need left to like reach 4,000 watch time hours? I'm hoping that by the time I'm saying this, I'm reaching it, I've reached it, something like that, whichever one. Um, first YouTube video has to be like my intro video and um, it's a year since I posted that video today. So I'm quite excited, you know, about that. That's my first YouTube video. First concert I ever attended, first concert I ever attended was Cardi B's concert last year in December. Like, 
I say in Ibadan, do we really have concerts here? So like it was that was my first time going out for a concert and just and it was really really good. I don't know why I haven't been going for concerts since. I really wish I have been going for concerts since. It's a good experience and I cannot wait for us to have concerts again. Like is that something that's going to come back? Are we going to recover and have concerts this December? I doubt it, but I'm gonna miss that. First person I talked to today, my sisters. I think yeah, when I woke up, I sent them a message. Yeah, first person I talked to today. First person that I text when something exciting happens. Same thing has to be my sister. It's like I just go to the group chat and I'm like, da, 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 da. guys, this happened. Or I send the voices and I just rant and I scream and I you know express myself. But like they're like the first set of people I tell when things happen. If it's in school, I'll tell my girls first because they're like around me. They're in my room. They're beside me in class. So I'm just gonna hey guys this happened and it's like that so this is like the first set of people i tell exciting things when it happens first thing i do every morning first thing i do every morning would be check my phone i'm going to be 100 percent honest has to be check my phone know who has killed me overnight know if any of my bosses have screamed off my head um yeah so i check my phone first just to know what's going on then my mom will wake me up and then devotion, other things like that. Yeah, first thing I do when I get home, first thing I do when I get home is remove my shoes. I hate wearing shoes. I don't wear shoes in the house. I don't wear slippers in the house, nothing. So once I'm back, I'm always looking forward to wearing, I'm always looking forward to removing my shoes. I just hate, I just hate, hate, hate wearing shoes so much. First wedding I attended, first wedding I attended was my cousin's wedding in the village. That's the first one I remember attending. My mom probably carried me for some that i don't exactly recall but the first thing i remember was my cousin that got married one december like this when we we're back in the village when did i go to my first party my first party was in just one because my school we had parties we had six parties every single session two parties per term so it has to be my secondary school that's when i started you know attending proper parties you know first time first time i got in a fist fight um, um the first time i got in a fist fight has to be grade two grade two i slapped a girl in school yeah i don't know if she slapped me back i think she tried to but i weaved it or something like that but i know i slapped her and she was very very light skinned and that slap oh my god i saw my fingers i saw like two lines that you know i dropped there on her face I'm not proud of it, but like that was great too. That was, I'll call that my first fist fight. But if it's at home fight, ah, we don't defies is like nursery two, nursery three with my sister, with my brother. My brother trained me to be a wrestler. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Let me see, did I miss out anyone? Yes, first case would be when I was 15. I was at the mall. At that time, the guy was my closest friend like my best friend so that would be for you know first kiss first toy first first toy would be a doll i think her name was cindy i hated her so much i hated her so so much she was quite she was a really really ugly doll cindy yeah, i think that's her name she was a really really ugly doll and then i dumped her at some point i got other slim those barbie dolls then my sister took cindy and then revamped cindy she you know did cindy's hair she decided so close for cindy using it one trend and then i wanted cindy back okay i'm like nigerian man <laughs> i was like nigerian man but let me put it that way but like yeah um that's that would be my very first toy cindy a very ugly what's made to be fine baby doll okay so i think that brings me to the end some other ones i can't relate to like getting a speeding ticket getting drunk sleepovers some of the things i really cannot relate to so let me know um if we have anything in common with like our first time like was my first phone the same as your first phone you know things like that in the comment section and um let me know if you found this video a bit fun i enjoyed sharing about you know first times for different things and jumping on this tag i will drop a link to the page that has the questions in case you also want to do something similar on your channel or you just feel like answering the questions okay so thank you guys so much for watching this video stay safe you know stay popping stay beautiful and i'll see you guys in my next one